What's up guys? Today I'm going to be showing you how to do this cool uh, sun kind of glow effect in Adobe Illustrator. Uh, this is my nine millionth time trying to record this, so I pray to God that it is working this time and that it's not laggy and that nothing gets corrupted. So we're going to click File New, um, 1920 by 1080. Uh, you can do whatever you want for this, does not matter at all. Won't make a difference. Create a new thing. Done. Alright, so I'm gonna make a background real quick just to kinda make it easier to see what I'm doing. So I just made a 1920 by 1080 rectangle. Um, I'm gonna turn off the stroke and I'm gonna recolor it a dark bluish color. Just like that. This is not very important. Your background can be literally anything you want. Easy stuff. So I'm just gonna lock it. I'm gonna lock this layer. Uh, I'm gonna rename it BG um, and just gonna lock it, put it away. I don't want to touch it again. So I'm gonna make a second layer, just this little thing right down here. I'm gonna rename this one uh, Spears. I'm gonna rename it Spears. I couldn't actually remember if I knew how to spell that for a second there, which is why I um, didn't, didn't write it right away. Um, yeah. So yeah. All right, so I'm gonna click on, I'm gonna left click and hold on the rectangle, and it's gonna bring up the ellipse tool. I click once for the ellipse. I'm gonna make it um, be 300 by 300. Um, pick something that you think will will fit nicely in your image, and you can always you can always resize it. Um, hold Shift and resize. Uh, you can always do that, not a problem. So once you've got it, um, I'm just gonna yeah, I don't really care. Put it wherever you want it, wherever you need it. You can move it later. Not a big deal. So, I'm going to recolor it. Something that's easier to see, like white. We, again, you can do whatever you want with this. So now I've got this white sphere. Right? And I'm going to... I'm actually going to center it. Wait, is it in the center? Yeah, it is. That is not the center. It's a straight up lie. Whatever. Now, I'm going to click on I'm gonna click on the object, the sphere. The ellipse. I'll make sure it's selected. I'm going to click on it. Go to Object. Path. Offset Path. I'm going to offset it by an amount that I think is reasonable, like 40. 40 is very reasonable. You can click on Preview and you'll see what it looks like. So you kind of want like this much space between. Um, but you know it's kind of up to whatever you're looking for. So I'm going to do 40. I'm going to click OK. And I'm just going to do that a bunch more times. So I'm going to do Path, Offset Path, and I'm just going to keep doing it. Do this until you have at least at least four new paths. So I've got four of them, and that's good for me. So you can see uh, there are a bunch of these little rings. So next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to select all of these. I'm going to hold Shift and click next to each one of them, but I'm not going to click the middle one. The middle one, I don't want it. All right. So now I've got all the outside rings except for my original. All right. So don't don't move them like I just did. That was just for show. So now I've got them all selected. I'm going to click on Properties. If properties isn't a thing for you, go into Window, click Properties. All right, so I'm going to click on Properties. I'm going to click on Opacity. I'm going to type in 15%, Enter. And there it is. It is done. You have done it. So you can see it, they all kind of fade out. And yeah, that's uh, that's that's how it is. That's, how, that's very easy. Um, so please tell me this is recorded. Um, if you enjoyed this video, if it helped you out, leave a like and go subscribe for more tutorials. If you need help with something, or you want me to try to do a tutorial on something else, um, I'm just learning Illustrator right now because uh, I switched my major to graphic design, so I have to learn how to use it. Um, so I'm not the greatest at it, but I will try to answer any questions that you might have. So comment those down below. I hope you guys enjoy it. Please yourself well. Have a great day.